everybody, my name's Rosie and welcome, welcome, welcome to my channel. How are you all? I hope you're all doing really, really well. So today we have not one, but two P. Louise budget box unboxings. Basically what happened is some of February's boxes were sent out really, really late due to some stock issues and I received mine really late. And then my March box was due not long afterwards. So I thought I would just wait and film them both together. I've managed to avoid all sneak peeks, so I still don't know what's in either of the boxes. But if you do know what's in February's box and you're just interested in seeing what's in March's box you I will put a timestamp down below so that you can skip forward to check that out now if you don't know about P. Louise budget boxes she releases these every month now and they get sent out on the last day of the month so although although these videos come into you in April it's actually March's box and March and April's box won't be with you till May I hope that makes sense these boxes cost 30 pounds I took out a six month subscription I thought I'd take out six months and see how I get on with it but if you did just want to buy a one-off box you absolutely can and there's also option to buy a 12 uh, month subscription as well if you are new here i do have two little pugs you'll hear them soaring and grunting throughout every video Lo peggy is currently climbing all over me like a little mountain goat that she is so february's box is so cutely packaged it is so beautiful. I love all of this. It was their birthday month. But it says, P. Louise, you're officially invited to the base's birthday. And it says, go on, babe, cake it on. Here's what the box looks like. I say it in every single one of these videos. P. Louise goes all out on her packaging. It's always so beautiful. When we open it up, here's everything. A quick sneak peek. And I can see we've got a full-size palette in there, which is amazing. So first off, the first thing I'm picking out is... I'm picking out a Holla Mini and this is their lip gloss which I do already have a full size of and it's really lovely. I'm not seeing that she does a mini one. Look how adorable that is. I, I really enjoy this gloss. I'm definitely going to keep hold of this one because this would be a great one to carry around in a little bag for a night out. Absolutely love that. So adorable. Next up we have a brush. We, cut, we quite often get brushes in these and I really like that because her brushes are really, really nice. This is from the Cancelled Collection and it looks like a little concealer brush, which is perfect. I'll get used out of that. That's a hashtag 7072. Next up we have one of the brow gels. This is the Defined Brow Gel in Blonde blend now i'm pretty sure i have tried one of these before but the brush was a little bit big for me so i gave it away and because of the shade of this it probably a bit light for me so yeah that's definitely going to be too light so i'm going to pass that on to somebody else who will get lots of use out of it but again it's a new um a newer item that she has the one great thing about these boxes is you either get things that are pretty new they've been out for a short amount of time or things that aren't even released yet so it's not a box where they're trying to clear old stock which i really enjoy that next up we have the acid rain blank canvas this is um in collaboration with mitchell i don't have this so that's great and it is a sort of little peachy nudie colour, which is perfect if you want to use it as an eyeshadow base. And then we have this massive palette. Wow, so this is a Beauty in the Breakup palette. So this is new. I've not seen this before. I've managed to avoid all spoilers. This is so adorable. This is so cool. So here's the packaging. And inside it's like all these little band-aids that like move around although mine are a bit wedged and they all have little affirmations on it so like the first one says a wound won't heal unless you leave it alone and another one says let it out then let it go I've got one that says stick to your own lane there's loads of different ones that is just adorable and then her signature little clasp oh my god that is beautiful I really love P. Louise's shimmers. I love her eyeshadow formula, but her shimmers are beautiful. And that is no exception. That is stunning. I don't think the camera's going to do it any justice. That's absolutely beautiful. We've got some really lovely looking shimmers in there, as well with some lovely mattes. And I love that all the little um, stamps that she puts on her eyeshadows as well. So yeah, I think for 30 quid to have a brand new palette in there and those other bits, you really can't complain. So that's February's box. Let's move on to March's. I have no idea what's in March's. I haven't seen any sneak peeks. But I do know that she's brought out an egg oh, this year. So I do wonder if it's got anything like that in it. Yeah, we have got one of the eggs. So here is a sneak peek of what we've got. 
I didn't buy one of the eggs because I did wonder if it would be in here. But we've got so much more than just that as well. Okay, so first off, like I said, we've got one of the eggs and I've got the green one. So it says, the content of this box is extra, extra special. Got little bunnies on it and stuff. These are so cute. And here's what it looks like. How adorable is that? That is so adorable. And then when you open it up, it's full of some goodies. So the first thing we have in here is the fall in line don't be afraid to fly babe we're all just winging it so it's a liquid liner liner and it's a double-sided one so you've got one that is called sugar snap and the other one's called she's mint i'm assuming all boxes would have had sort of different colors in it i know that there's a pink one um i think a blue one as well i can't remember now off the top of my head but that's what it looks like and these are brand new guys so I've just done a really quick line on my hand and they're really cute little sort of pastel-y colours, really pretty. Next up we have one of the Stay Shining uh, lip oils. I've got a few of these now, so I'll probably pass this one along. This is called Indulge Me. Just rip the packaging. And here's what that one looks like. Oh my God, that smells like toffee. It's like caramel. So yeah, another lip oil. I do really love the lip oils, but I've got quite a few now. So I'll probably find that one a good home, but it smells absolutely beautiful. And then we have one of the liquid shadows, and this is in Spring Sister. Again, these are new. I've not tried these, not seen it. Look at that packaging. So adorable. Look at that colour, wow. So it's like a really moussey texture. Look at that colour. That is stunning. Absolutely beautiful. Really excited to play with that too. Okay, so that's the first thing, which is the egg. Let's see what else we've got in this box. So next up, we have the Protect Your Pout Choco Loving Lip Conditioner. Again, I've got quite a few of the lip conditioners now. I do use them a lot. They're really, really lovely. Um, and this is a chocolate one. So I'll, again, I'll probably pass it on just because I've got so many. But they come with this little clip. And look, it's got a little chocolate on it. That is so adorable. Um, and yeah, they're little lip conditioners. They're really lovely lip balms. If you lo I love lip balms. I use things like that all the time. Really conditioner on your lips, as the packaging says. So, And that's a flavour that I've not seen before. Next up, we have something from her skin range. This is the texture treatment. The packaging is super cute. I'm not 100% sure what it is. I'd have to Google it and have a look. Oh, oh my God, that is super runny. I've just got that everywhere. Oh, that smells amazing. Be careful when opening it, though, guys. I've just literally got that everywhere. Okay, so it says, allow our texture treatment to instantaneously melt away your makeup to unveil radiant and glowing skin. So, I'm assuming it's like a cleanser, which is fantastic. I love to try a new cleanser out. It does smell absolutely beautiful. And that retails for £30 alone, so that is just crazy. Then we have a little brush that actually goes with that as well. So you can obviously spoon it out. And then you have a little muslin cloth which goes with that as well. So this contains three muslin cloths and it's to be used with the texture treatment. So you put it onto your face and neck and it removes your makeup and grime from the day, etc, etc. And then you use your muslin cloths to help melt that away. And here it comes in a little packet. So... That's everything that we got in the Marches box. So that's quite cute. Like we got a little skincare regime, which is your cleanser, your mousse and cloths and your little brush. And then you've got everything in the egg, which was the new eyeliner, the new moussey eye cream eyeshadow, which has dried really nicely actually. You've got the lip oil and a lip conditioner in that. I think these for 30 quid guys are absolutely amazing. I'm super super happy with both boxes and I can't wait to see what's in next month. Let me know your thoughts guys. Do you get these already or is it something that would intrigue you or is it just something that's not for you? I'd love to hear either way. But thank you so so much for watching guys. I really do appreciate it and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Bye! Mm -hmm.